Hi guys, thank you so much for joining me. I hope you guys are having an awesome day. Today I am participating in a collaboration. This is called the Christmas Decorations Unboxing Winter Edition 2019. And this is being hosted by Karen Jeter from Everyday Living with Karen Jeter. And her co-host is Cheryl from Miss Cheryl's Place. I will also have their links down in my description box along with the playlist so please check out everybody's videos. So what I'm going to be doing is sharing uh, an unboxing of all of my Christmas, not all of them, but I chose one box from my garage and I'm going to be unboxing it and just showing you guys a little bit of what I have in there and as well as something that I picked up from the store. So if you guys are interested, please keep watching. Okay guys, here is just one box that I picked up from my garage. I have a whole lot of um, Christmas decor, but I just picked up this one. And this doesn't have that much in it, but this box has some really pretty red garland that I like. Um, I think it's really pretty, I forgot. I'm just going through this stuff randomly. Don't really know what's in here. Got some floral picks here. Here's another one with some cherries or berries and a pine cone. Super cute. This little Christmas tree, these are so cute. I love these little Christmas trees. And let's see, I have a stocking that was just thrown in there. <laughs> it just says Merry Christmas, with some lights on it. Then I have a, I guess you call these Christmas trees. I'm not sure what you call these, snow cones, Christmas trees decor. So I have two of these, but I think the other one is in another box. And <laughs> thrown in here miscellaneous are these ornaments. I don't know why, because I don't pack that good. I just put stuff in boxes and in my, um, what do you call it, those plastic bins. You know, I don't have a strategic way of doing it. I just throw it in there, pack it up. And then I have an old plain wreath that I might do a DIY with. I don't know. Not, I'm not the greatest DIYer, but maybe I'll do it. I don't know. <laughs> then I have an old uh, village house. It's so cute. Then I've got this little light, uh, Christmas tree light thing. And I think the battery, yep, the battery's gone. I probably have to try to open it and see if you can actually place something in there. But... If not, it's still cute for, you know, decor purposes. Then I've got these other two Christmas trees that are the traditional colors. I think they're so cute. Really adorable. And I've got a few more ornaments in here. Little red ornaments and this other little pick. That's cute. I like that. And another wreath. This one's pretty. I love the little berries. I guess these are berries. Okay, and also when I went to Walmart, like I told you guys, I would show you this pretty little Christmas tree that I picked up uh, from Walmart. And it was about $5 at $4.98. And it has some burlap wrapped on the bottom, but I think it's super cute. It has a little a little sign that says Merry Christmas. And I have another video that I'm gonna be featuring this in. So you guys will have to stay tuned and watch out for that one. Also, I went to uh, Home Goods looking for some Christmas decor and I just picked up these few things. And I think this little mug is so cute. This is not the one that I really wanted. If there was one particular one that I saw earlier when I went in and I did not pick it up so when I came back that night of course you know it was gone so that was a bummer but this is one this one's cute I like it it has the little 
uh, sweater. Cute is Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer. I thought it was adorable. It's kind of whimsical. Not quite what I wanted, but that's okay. It's still nice and Christmassy. Uh, I think this one was $5. It's really cute. Then I picked up these little bath towels that are so pretty. It has little Christmas trees on them. I think this one was ooh, five. Let me see how much was this. This one was $6.99, if I'm seeing that right. Yes, yeah, $6.99. And it comes in a pack of six bath towels. And then here is another towel for the bathroom. And this one costs. $5.99 so this is really cute I wanted something red and um, has a little reindeers on it okay guys this is the last thing that I'm going to share with you today I have a little vignette going on on this <laughs> coffee table that I put together and I think it's looking really cute I have a little white tablecloth around the table this is my coffee table in the living room and then I added this really pretty Merry Christmas stocking. And then I have the garland that you saw around the table in a circular way. And then over here to the right, I have two pine cones. And I like these pine cones because of the color. It's kind of like wintry. Not so much Christmassy, but winterish. Kind of like it makes you think of like snow, blizzards. I don't know. That's what I think of. And then the little Christmas trees over here to the right. In the back there, I have some florals, the little white florals that I showed you earlier in that vase. And then I have my little Christmas trees. There's that one there, the next size up, and then the tallest one right here. And then, of course, the little village house. And then on underneath the village house, I have just my coasters there. Let me show you. Little sparkly coasters, and I'll just set that right there. And that's it. I think this is really, really cute. It speaks Christmas and it speaks definitely winter. Thank you, Karen, and thank you, Cheryl, for hosting this. This was a lot of fun, ladies. Thank you so much. If you're not yet a member of the Home Decorating with Liz family, please click on that subscribe button and click on that notification bell. Make sure you tap it twice so that you will be notified of my new videos. Thank you so much to all my faithful and family friends for watching. Have a blessed day. Bye-bye.